Aunt Li, who lives in the Chengdu Haijiao Shi Street, is a well-deserved queen of noodles. A noodle restaurant named Tianmen Noodle with soybean sauce has been opened for 23 years, silently nourishing generations of people in Eastern Chengdu. Now, Aunt Li has reached the age of retirement, and her son Chen Rei shouldered a heavy responsibility to keep the business of the small noodle restaurant flourishing. People who know the noodles are waiting to travel for a bite of the delicious noodles. The Tianmen Noodle with soybean sauce restaurant has owned two items of intangible cultural heritage. The story behind it is more touching than what you can see. My mother is in 1999, from the Liangui Xilu, in 2007, started making noodles. Then, just only one of the noodles. I was from little, I just ate my mother's noodles. Now, this noodle is growing on my hand. Now, this noodle is growing on my hand. As a second generation of noodle maker, Chen Rei has learned 80 or 90 percent of his mother's skills. He even does better than his mom. The old Chengdu sweet and spicy noodle that he made is chewy at first bite, with sweet and tasty sauce. A bowl of sweet and spicy noodles alone enables him to capture the hearts of generations. Here you can see the complete process of making a bowl of noodles: boiling the noodles, stir frying the minced meat, making a soup, and seasoning the noodles. All of these are finished in just one go. The restaurant only sells one type of noodle that are roughly made of leek leaves, which is brought from the handmade noodle store next door that has been in business for over 30 years. But the proportions are all mixed by Chen Rei himself. Tianmen Noodle Restaurant was listed in the top 50 Chengdu noodle restaurants for three consecutive years, and top 50 Chengdu fine diners for two consecutive years. The cooking method of the traditionally made noodles with soybean sauce and Chengdu oil tea. Were inscribed on the list for intangible culture heritage. It can be said that Tianmen Noodle Restaurant is a Chengdu fine diner that are definitely worth trying. Many people ask me, "Why are you not doing the lesson, doing the Jiamong, or what is it? Why are you not doing the lesson? 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 Why are you not Chen Rei felt the responsibility on his shoulders suddenly become heavy. He actively and personally promotes traditional Chengdu snacks to let more people know the real taste of oil tea with five spices, marinated tofu pudding in rice wine, and chilled spicy bean jelly salad. To let Tianmen know and loved by more people is a long way to go. Young Chengdu natives have gradually awakened, no longer staying away from real life. Instead. They're storing up inner energy to inherit the craft's wealth. The future of Chengdu fine diners, with their engagement, has become clear and promising.